Hi everyone, <clears throat> I'm going to do a couple of little videos uh, showing different methods of quilt as you go and I've put this quilt up, it's actually the very first quilt I made and it's very very simple and it's very special meaning to me because all the patches within it are made from my dad's old shirts and it was I made it the year after he died and I cut squares up, chopped them all up. The purple around the outside was my daughter's duvet cover when she was at home and I chopped that up to make the uh, the frame, make it a little bit bigger. Uh, when I look at it, it's so full of mistakes, but do you know what? I don't care. Uh, it hasn't even got any wadding inside because when I first started it, I didn't know what wadding and batting meant. So it actually has an old blanket in the middle, also it belonged to my mum and dad. Uh, so it's very special to me. I just got a new machine that had some embroidery stitches on and so I quilted it using embroidery stitches and I remember taking it to a first class that I went to and showed it to the teacher and she looked a bit disapproving as if to say mm, yes David that's not how we do it but you know what it's how I did it and I used it as my yoga blanket for a long time and I've just dug it back out of the cupboard and I think I'm going to leave it up there because it's got special memories. So this technique can be used for lots of different things and I'm going to show you some other things uh, later on in the series. So for this one to start, there's nine blocks, as you can see, three by three. And we have to start with nine pieces of fabric. Now with this, when I made it, I used the back of my dad's shirts and I cut them into squares. But if you've got nine fat quarters, which is this, so we've got 22 by 18, the easiest thing to do is to make a square from a fat quarter and all you have to do is fold the short side up so you've got a perfect triangle and trim that piece off and then you will have an 18 inch square. So for this size, we need to start with nine squares. So if you haven't got nine fat quarters, just cut nine squares. But because there's lots of chopping with this, you need to start much bigger than you need. So I would go as big as you possibly can. So say this is 18. If you can manage a 16 inch square, then go with that. So I'm gonna show you now the next stage.